How's it going everyone? My name is AJ and today I'm going to answer a health question. Intermittent fasting has been surging in popularity lately as a simple and effective weight loss strategy. But exactly how much weight can you lose? And of this weight, is it fat, muscle, or a combination of both? I am going to answer these questions based on what current science has shown. If you are interested to see where I pull my information from, feel free to check out the description below. And without further delay, let's get started. A 2005 study published out of the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition took 16 subjects of normal weight and put them on an intermittent fasting diet. At the end of this three-week study, subjects lost an average of 2.5% of their body weight and approximately 4% of their fat mass. Similar studies looking at different intermittent fasting protocols came up with similar results, with 3% reductions in body weight over three weeks and a 9% reduction in body weight over the course of 12 weeks. These numbers work out to an average of one to two pounds of body weight lost per week. To put these numbers into perspective, this is roughly the same amount of weight you would lose if you went on the keto diet, Atkins diet, paleo diet, or any other diet available out there for an extended period of time. Although intermittent fasting is effective, it is by no means superior from a weight loss perspective to any of the other diets out there. But of this weight lost, is it fat or could you be dipping into your muscle gains? Let's take a closer look. Most people's initial thought is that if you are not regularly refueling your body throughout a resistance training program, you're not going to gain any muscle and in fact you could actually lose muscle. It turns out this isn't true. Intermittent fasting, even for as long as 72 hours, will not break down skeletal muscle, will not slow down protein synthesis, and will not slow down your metabolism as long as you continue to engage in regular resistance training. If anything, you might actually gain more muscle from intermittent fasting. A pair of recent studies have suggested that after a 24 hour fast, your body may be more sensitive to the anabolic effects that protein intake might have on muscle growth. Simply put, the key to shredding fat and building muscle during a fast is to continue to resistance train throughout the week. So back to the original question. How much weight can I lose from intermittent fasting? Based on the results of the studies I presented, you can expect to lose anywhere from one to two pounds, at least for the first three months or so. And as long as you continue to lift regularly, you shouldn't lose a single fiber of your precious muscle gains. Do you have a fasting experience that you would like to talk about? Feel free to let me know in the comments below or on Facebook or Twitter. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like it, share it with your friends, and subscribe. I release new videos every week. In any case, thank you all so much for watching, and stay strong.